What's up everyone? Steve here again with another skate park tour. This time I'm in Sturdivant, Wisconsin at an evergreen skate park build. Um, this thing was built about two years ago, so 2021, 20, 2020, something like that. Um, it's a relatively small park and a smaller community, but the kids love it. It's a lot of fun. It skates kind of like a pump track basically one big donut with obstacles spread throughout and it's pretty low impact really smooth so let's go check it out all right so we're going to start by going um, off to the left so clockwise as you're entering into the park first thing we've got is a hub -a ledge um, also kind of bumped a ledge or out ledge whatever you want to call it um, the out ledge part is about eight feet long and the hubba part is about six feet long it's about 18 inches tall um, again skates like a small smaller hubba um, the the pitch kind of shoots you straight into the ground um, so that's just a result of how short the, the down ramp is but you do get some options on this as you can see next thing that we'll get to is this bowl section on the north end of the park. Um, it's got a mixture of kind of like pump track, like flowy type of setup to it. Um, kind of egg shaped, but as you can see, there's about, um, you know, a couple of sections of coping set in throughout that range anywhere from about two feet tall to three feet tall with roll-in sections um, to make it easy to get into. But um, some of those bow out a little bit and some of them curve in. So really a lot of different carving options to get all sorts of grinds through here. So a lot of uh, kind of interesting shaping to this stuff, kind of a challenge to skate, um, but also super fun. So you'll see kind of how this is all arranged right here. All right, now as we move to um, the, I guess you would say it's the, the Eastern side of this, this loop, um, we got a few more uh, rollers to pump over. So we'll go over those. Um, these are about, I would say about two feet tall, uh, depending on uh, which one you're looking at. Um, so as we kind of carve through that, you're gonna notice we go over a pyramid ramp, um, and this has a rainbow rail that's square over the top of it, which you can see. So that's kind of an interesting feature to it. One thing that's kind of nice about this park um, is that they did pour a cement slab right next to it, just for flat ground and um, it hasn't gotten any kind of like additions met, added to it like curbs or anything like that but as you can see some people have put down some flat bars and boxes and stuff like that good place to play skate it is brush cement so it could be smoother but um, not a bad thing to have in your local park this thing is about um, 25 feet wide or so and probably about 50 feet long now as we kind of go to the south end of the park you see another bold section uh, but before we get there we've got this like s uh shaped square rail flat bar kind of skinny on top but as you can see it it sort of weaves through which is great um so it gives gives skaters plenty of trick options um but let me go back through the south end of the park more of a, a straightforward bowl section, not as weavy um, in and out as the north end. It's got kind of a camel hump through the middle of it um, and really one big long quarter that's only about two feet long or two feet tall, I should say. Last but not least, we've got a box. This thing is about six feet long and 12 inches tall. And then we've got a circle down rail um, that is probably three inches in diameter and um, skates look both like a bump to bar and a down rail. So really quite a few options for doing a lot of different types of tricks. All right, so that does it for the Sturdivant Skate Park. Uh, thanks for checking out this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any questions about the park, 
just let me know in the comments and I'll answer them. But otherwise, I'll see you on the next video and stay tuned for more skate park tours. Later.